Hey, what's going on there, guys? So today we're gonna go try to catch some surf perch on the Oregon coast, and we are using these baits right here. Um, these are the gulp shrimp, and uh, they work pretty good. These are the two-inch size. Um, I've been catching some pretty big surf perch with these. Uh, they do make a three-inch as well, okay? But I'm using a two-inch, and this is the natural color. Of course, my tried and true still holds. These are the Gulf sandworms. Um, these work just as good. Um, I don't think it really matters. The shrimp comes in about, I believe, eight to nine dollars a pack. You get eight of them. And the sandworms, um, they're about seven, eight dollars a pack. You get 24. So price, um, price difference is quite significant. But anyways, uh, using the Gulf shrimp today. Um, for my rig, um, just checking some emails that I read, uh, cause I've been kind of staying home lately, um, for the rig. The high-low rig is all I use, guys. There's really, I think 99% of the time people are using the high-low rig for catching surf perch here on Oregon coast. To tie the dropper loop is really easy. You just take the line and make a loop and then just twist these two lines like that, okay? twist it go about six times you have that hole right there put your finger through there and grab the bottom loop and go back up through that uh, hole and basically you want to keep this loop that you pull through keep it kind of taut all right and just try to carefully work to tighten the two loops down here it's kind of tricky um, you almost have to kind of you know, adjust it with your fingers because um, it can easily slide out. And once you have it, you just tighten that up. Okay, so that is your dropper loop. Okay, so I put on two to three uh, dropper loops for my high-low rig. Um, these work. This rig works really good on the Oregon coast. It never tangles. The only time it tangles is if you make that loop too long because it's gonna swing around and uh, probably get caught on the other hook or on the bottom hook. Okay, so keep this short. I would say like three inches at the most for that loop, all right? And that's where your hook goes. So high-low rig, and I use a two ounce weight and I use um, a number two bait holder hook by Gamagasu, uh, very sharp hooks. For my rod and reel, uh, 10 foot, and size 4,000 reel, 20 pound braid. Sometimes I use 30 pound braid. Um, doesn't matter, okay? You wanna use braid line because it's very, very, very sensitive. It's much more sensitive than mono and it doesn't stretch. So you get a good hook set, all right? So that's the gear. So let's go catch some surf perch. Oh. Woo, first cast. Early morning, foggy. Man, this beach, the contour has changed quite a bit. Oh, yeah! Oh, nice! Little baby. Sweet. At least you got one. On the shrimp, huh? Yep. Nice. All right, Brian is on the board. Brian's got another one. That's fast. Number two. Oh, the, look at that, he's getting bigger. Nice, man, he's getting bigger. Good cast, good fish. Cool. Sweet. I'm gonna go to your right. <laughs> Oh, Brian's got a crab. <laughs> oh, man. Dang, Brian. Multi-species, dude. <laughs> That's a female. Oh, look at that. <laughs> she wants that shrimp. Yeah, it's hooked. Here. Okay, buddy. Come here. <laughs> there you go. Nah. 
you guys, it's all right. Now, now. Oh, you got it right at the mouth. Come here. There you go. Yeah, there you go. First crab. You got the first crab and the first fish. How about that? Okay, girl. There you go. Back you go. Yep. There we go. <laughs> nice. Oh, there we go. Fish on, guys. Fish on. Woo! Finally, I'm on the board. Well, assuming I can uh, land him, did Brian get another crab? Oh, he feels really small though. Holy smokes. I am, I'm curious which bait he took. Did he take the shrimp or that uh, Z-Man? Oh, he took the, no, he took the shrimp. Took the shrimp. There we go, guys, first fish. Oh, there he goes. Oh, other way, buddy. Other way. <laughs> Look at that. Okay, there he goes. So, finally I'm on the board. A lot of seaweed. Cool. That was fun. Let's see if we can get another one. I think Brian's got another one. <laughs> Did he get a crab? Is that another crab, Brian? <laughs> Your third crab? Are you serious? Holy cow! Yeah! <laughs> it's like the same one, huh? Come here, you. Ah, uh, no. <laughs> yeah, you just grab him by the back leg like that. I grabbed him yeah. like that one time and he reached around and got me. Yeah. Oh. Uh, come here. Okay. Oop. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Three crab, two fish. <laughs> Three crab, two fish. Hey, not skunk, right? Another female? Okay, I got a reel. All right, girl. Get out of here. There you go. Go home. Stay off our line. All right, guys. So 30 minutes, 45 minutes, actually. One fish, and that's it been a really slow morning. Brian has two fish and I think he said three crabs. <laughs> oh man, oh man. Foggy day on the Oregon coast. Can't see anything. Can you guys see anything? Nothing. It's all gray around me. Well, there's Brian over there. Uh, I'm thinking we want to head north a little bit. I don't know. There is a lot of seaweed when I cast. And usually it's like that when the tide fluctuation is so high. Anything, Brian? Getting a lot of seaweed. Oh, man. Yeah. A little taps. Okay. Try to pull it off I think there's a like a little trough right here, and that's where the crabs are staying. Yeah, I'm guessing because they're staying there where, they, where I don't know if they're just like laying eggs or maybe there's food there. I don't know. But man, it's a tough morning. You want to try to head north and see if there's anything there? Well, yeah. yeah, let's do it.
Ryan's on. Feels like a good one, Brian. Ah. Oh, it got off. Yeah, I'm getting some hits too, just right here. I'm just not landing them. <laughs> yeah, that hit I had was huge. Yeah. Oh yeah, here we go. Here we go, finally. Um, no. Yeah, maybe. He is just like a really tiny one though. Oh, 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 maybe not. I was getting good hits. Like I just had a really huge hit. Then I cast out and this guy got on, but he doesn't feel very big though. Does not feel big. Little guy. There we go, oh, barely hooked. There we go. Second fish of the day. Okay, buddy, hold on. There we go. Nice looking red tail. Gonna let this guy go. There you go, buddy. Thanks for the fun. Let's see if we can get another one. It has been a very slow, slow morning. So that was only my second fish in about two hours. It's just been dead. Okay, there we go. Got one? <laughs> nice. Little guy. Brian just got one. Not a very big one. They are definitely on a small side today. Uh, it doesn't matter. Just out here having fun, you know? Oh, oh, there we go. There we go. Better one, guys. Here's a better one. I can tell when he hit. Nice fish. Yeah, he's definitely a better one than the last. Yep, there he is. Oh, I should know. He's about the same. About the same size, right there. Okay, okay, stop shaking. Okay. All right, there we go. All right, guys, there we go. Third fish. Probably about a nine, nine and a half inches. Not a very big one. Fun, though. That's a male. There you go. Bye bye, buddy. Catching them on these gulp sand shrimp. Not sand worms, sand shrimp. These guys right here. <clears throat> okay, there we go. So where we're fishing, guys, is we're on this little, uh, kind of like a uh, sandbar. And so we're a little bit further out on the beach. If you can find a sandbar, it's always a good place to start because uh, they jut out further into the ocean. So there is a seal out there. right in the vicinity where I caught the two fish. So, I think if there's a seal there, it just means he's going after the surf perch. That's what I'm guessing. And people think if there's a seal there, you should move. But in most cases, I catch a lot of surf perch where there's seal. Oh yeah, there we go guys. There's another one. There's another one. See it? I knew it. There's, if there's a seal there, that means um, there's perch there too because the seals, they follow the perch school. Oh yeah, feels like a better one. Look at that head shake. Oh baby. Definitely feels like a nice one. But, oh yeah, good one. Oh man, oh man. 
good one, guys. Oh, he took it deep. Dang it. Oh, shoot. Hey, Brian. Do we have pliers? Got to bring my hook out. Oh, kind of rusted, but... oh it's all. Ugh. There we go. Well, there we go. No, I'm just gonna let him go. There she goes. Yeah, I don't know if she's gonna survive, but I just let Mother Nature take care of it. Yeah, I saw a seal too. All right, guys, so I cut off one of my hook and I only got one hook left. So I'm just gonna use that. So just single hook, it's all right. I'm just too lazy to tie on another hook. There's just so much downtime. And I'm, I'm about to go soon, so I'll just use one hook. We're good. I'm just casting it out there. I'm not like winging it really hard. I'm probably casting about 70 to 80 feet. So it's not very far at all. And I just let my my bait sit out there. Put my line on my thumb um, on my finger like this so I can feel the bite. Oh yeah! Woo! There we go! There we go guys! Back to back, buddy. Even one hook's gonna work. Doesn't matter. Another good one. Another good one. Oh, look at this. Nice size, guys. Oh, there he goes. He's gone. So that was what, number three, four? Number four, I think? I can't remember. Oh, there he is, right there. See that? Right there, at the tip of my rod. That was cool. Okay, there we go. Let's see if I can get another one back to back. Got a fish? Oh, another fish, guys. I think. No, yeah. What do I got? I got your line. Oh man! Woo! Nice! Yeah! That's a big one! Woo! Check it. <laughs> this is what we get for uh, fishing too close to each other. Yeah, that's a female. Ah, uh, shoot. Sorry, dude. Oh, uh, let me see. This could be, uh... Okay, what's going on? They don't have eggs, so what is this? Yeah, that's weird. Came right out of her. D those are eggs? Yeah, it looked like eggs. Oh, wow. I didn't think they had eggs. Yeah. Because we squished them before and like babies came out. Remember? Yeah, it's full of babies. Let's let her go. Let me, let me see you release it. Let's do it. Let's release her. Nice, man. Yeah, she's full of babies. Nice catch. Yeah, right here. Ready? Yep, ready. Go ahead. Yeah, there she goes. There she goes. Nice catch. Thought I had a fish, but it turned out that I caught Brian's line. <laughs> and this is what happens when you fish too close to each other. Yeah, that was a nice fish he caught. Ooh, I had a bite. Had a bite. Slow down. Oh, there we go. There we go. Fish on. I think. Do I got one on? I felt like there's a hit. Oh, no, it came off. Dang it, came off. Oh, man. Came off. That was a good hit. Oh, yeah, there we go. There we go, guys. That's a hit. Holy moly. Woo! That was a nice hit. Nice hit, guys. Let's, oh, nice fish. Nice fish, nice hook set. 
Oh my goodness. Look at that. That is a nice female. She's full of babies. Got to be careful. Be gentle. Don't wiggle. Don't wiggle. Oh, geez, big wave. Come on, there we go. There we go. There's a nice red tail right there, guys. Let her go. There we go. Boom, she's gone. Other way, other way. <laughs> there she goes, she got it. Oh, nice. Oh, what a slap. There you go, man. Another female. Wow. That's a big perch. Yeah, there you go. Perfect. Woo! Nice. Yeah, it's a really good spot. Yeah, there you go, Brian. Double. Wow. Nice. There we go, guys. High low rig. Can't beat it. Nice, nice catch. Felt pretty good. Right yeah. <laughs> Sweet. Oh, there we go. Oh, I lost it. Dang. That was a good hit. Back to back. Brian's got another one already. Oh, man. That was a nice hit. Yep, there we go. Fish on. Fish on, guys. There's another. The tide is coming in too. We were fishing a low, uh, a low tide, uh, and now it's incoming. So they're coming in with the tide. Oh, it's a little guy. Seems like I'm catching the little ones, and Brian's catching all the big ones. Okay, there we go. There we go. Bye, bye, buddy. Go home. Grow big. Come back again. Catch you later. Oh, there we go. There we go. There's a nice one. I don't know what number this is. Five or six. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Wow. Woo. Oh, man. He feels, he feels big. He feels big. Yeah, that's a nice one. Oh, he's a monster. Oh, wow. Oh, he's a big one, guys. Oh, my goodness. Holy cow. Woo! That's a big female. Look at this. Oh, my goodness. Holy cow. There we go, guys. One of my biggest surfers in a long time. Check that out. That's a female, so we'll let her go. Nice. Got it on the uh, sand shrimp. Okay, there we go. There she goes. Other way. Other way. There she goes. Oh, yeah, that was cool. Okay, a couple more casts, we'll call it. Couple more cash, then we're gonna go home. <laughs>